Hundreds of people come to Los Angeles every single day to start a journey, fulfill a dream. Actors, singers, musicians, and comedians showcase their talents, hoping to catch the attention of someone who matters. This is the story of Rosie Trent, who came here from New Orleans in the summer of 2003 when she was 19 years old. I came out to Los Angeles to become a stand-up comic. Her parents thought she moved west to further her education. I think I'm going to make it to my parents, actually, that I want to do stand-up much more than go to school. And after seven years of struggle, she begins to understand the meaning of show business. Stand-up, man, it is the hardest job in show business. Yeah, I mean, you think, um, you know, the glamour, and you think Bill Cosby, Richard Pryor, and uh, I don't think you see the stuff that they went through in order to, to become the great comedians that they were. They never write a joke. They never go and do it. Oh, I could be a comedian. Can you? Can you be a comedian? That's the real question. Are you going to go and do the work? Okay, so now we're really lucky to welcome to the stage, please welcome her, Rosie Tran. We are here at the Comedy Show, right? Rosie, this is just the worst location you could have picked. So you have, you have no identity. You can't say, well, I'm Jerry Seinfeld. Come on. You don't know who I am. George Lloyd by Georgia, they really... What about Rosie Tran? Rosie Tran. Funny? I wouldn't know her to stop either. I'm not. She goes, I really like you. You know, I know you. She said that. She goes, I know you and you're really funny, but I just think we got to save these three spots for bigger, bigger names. It's about finding who you are on stage. That's the real face change for the comedian is when they suddenly get their, some people call it their voice. 